Local hoop fans ended up disappointed after the cancellation of the much-anticipated match between Gilas Pilipinas and NBA stars. And Real Madrid continues to beef up its roster with its latest major acquisition. The sports wrap from Luigi Flores. Football club Real Madrid has formally announced Colombian midfielder James Rodriguez as its latest member. In a press conference, club president Florentino Perez announced Rodriguez's signing by displaying the player's number 10 jersey. Rodriguez, who reportedly inked an 80 million euro contract, said he is honored to become a Blanco. His signing is among the football club's blockbuster deals following German midfielder Tony Cruz's transfer from Bayern Munich. Rodriguez is also a World Cup Golden Boot awardee and last played for Monaco. In the NBA, an official says the Los Angeles Clippers are at a risk of losing its fan base, sponsors, and even its personnel if Donald Sterling is still with the team. Clippers interim CEO Richard Parson says a new owner must be in place before the start of next season. He also warns this could send the franchise into a death spiral. Sterling has been banned for life in the NBA for his taped racist remarks and was forced to give up the franchise. But the embattled businessman has vowed never to sell the Clippers, which he has owned for 30 years. The league said it may confiscate the franchise from the Sterlings and will be auctioned off if the $2 billion sale is not approved by September 15th. And the much-awaited showdown between Gilas Pilipinas and select NBA stars was cancelled at the last minute. Gilas head coach Chot Reyes announced that the last homestanding event will instead feature the national team's drills. Event organizers were forced to cancel the event after NBA officials threatened its players with penalties should they continue to play. The association ruled the anticipated ball game as unsanctioned. This triggered outrage among basketball fans who demanded a refund through social media. PLDT Chair Manny Pangilinan has offered his apologies to fans and has assured them a refund. Those in attendance may contact the following numbers posted on the screen for their ticket refunds. Luigi Flores reporting.